Hi Junior Giants, Coach Marissa here. Today we're going to be doing a little science experiment that deals with optical illusions and the refraction of light. Let's go check it out. So what happened? Well, the things that we see are a result of light rays that meet our eyes. When these light rays travel through air, they experience very little to no disturbance at all. As a result, we can see the coin clearly through the side of the glass when there is no water. However, light rays are met with disturbance or refraction in more specific terms when they travel through the water. So when we pour water into the cup, the light rays bend when they travel through the water before they reach our eyes. After the light rays pass through the side of the glass and the water, they are not able to reach our eyes, and as a result, we cannot see the penny. Refraction occurs because of the molecules and the substances that the light rays are passing through. In regards to air, gas molecules spread out and this is why little to no refraction occurs. But greater refraction occurs when light rays pass through a substance like water because molecules are closer together in liquids. So after the light rays are refracted through the water and the glass, the final image is projected near the top of the glass. And we can see this if we lift the plate and view the penny from the top of the glass. Hopefully you all learned something new from this video. And as always, go Junior Giants. Mm -hmm.